And it's one of the busiest times of the year for travel. And we have your travel forecast. La, 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 la. That's really good. Thank you. How long have you been working on that? Uh, all morning. I can tell. <laughs> Here's a look at your travel delays going into tomorrow. If you see green on the map, that is good news. No issues expected. You start seeing yellow, some minor concerns, red, purple. That's that's when you really that's need to pay attention. That's pretty good looking travel forecast yeah. weather wise. And it actually looks better in the early part of this week than it does as we get closer into the weekend. So if you can do some traveling uh, going into tomorrow, and kind of beat the uh, bad weather, it's probably a good idea. Here's a look at Thursday's uh, conditions, Matt. Yeah, there's a big low developing off uh, California, so there could be some issues for LA. That's the same system, by the way, Mickey, that's going to be impacting us perhaps on Christmas Day. Uh, but yeah, a little bit of rain across the central United States, but the East Coast from New York all the way down to Florida looking pretty We're good. Pretty nice. Miami looking nice, 70 degrees Ooh. and dry. I'll we take know, that. We need a remote weather forecast for there, don't we? That's right. Uh, this is a look at it Friday. And we start to see some of the storms develop into eastern uh, Texas, back through uh, the uh, desert southwest, well, Arizona and uh, Southern California, dealing with some storms. That's right. So there could be some issues if you're flying to Seattle, LA, Chicago, maybe Houston, and a Dallas area. So make sure you check into that before you travel on Friday. And as you can see, lots of rain across uh, Texas, some showers all the way up towards the Great Lakes. Mm -hmm. Once again, the East Coast looking good. So uh, we're still you, dry. Yeah, we're looking good. Uh, temperatures starting to warm and uh, get closer to average, but just kind of messy as you go down towards the uh, southwest U.S. and in the Pacific Northwest. Let's check Saturday, and uh, Saturday shows all those systems getting a little closer to us. So if you're doing some uh, travel around Georgia or uh, Mississippi, you're going to be okay, but you venture a little further to the west and to uh, Arkansas, back through Oklahoma, you're going to be running into some rain and maybe a few thunderstorms. Yeah, and there could be some snow in the Rockies uh, towards Denver. It says 47, but if you look towards the mountains to the west, that looks kind of snowy there. So sure does. just use caution. Hey, wherever you go for the holiday, we're looking nice. Uh, and just download the WBRC First Alert weather app and you can get those forecasts through there. You know what that was? Our travel forecast. La, 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 it's the travel. <clears throat> I really got to work on that song. Maybe publish it on a, a yeah. weather app. Mm, I don't know. I don't know. Safe travels. <laughs>